these sparkling ice zero sugar drinks so good if you haven't tried them go to Target and grab one that's why I got mine they might have them other places I'm addicted this one is the pink grapefruit and it is so good Welcome back to my channel. Today I have a huge spring Dollar Tree haul for you. Before we get started, hit that subscribe button down below, subscribe to my channel, turn on the little notifications bell so you're notified whenever I post a new video. All right, let's get started with this huge haul because it's gonna take a while because I have so much new things to show you that I got from the Dollar Tree. All right, I got the big bags and I actually filled up two of these big bags I've taken stuff out of one of them, but so much good stuff at my Dollar Tree right now. It's been a while. Just FYI, if you hear like a loud rumbling sound, they are clearing the land next to my house to put up a new house, so that might be in the background a little bit. But let's show you guys what I got. First of all, I have eyed these at my Dollar Tree for quite a while. These aren't a seasonal thing. Well, I guess they probably are. I guess they're kind of like a spring summer thing. I've seen them there in previous years, uh, but I never bought any because I didn't know what to do with them. So I did decide to pick up two of these like hanging baskets. Now I don't want to use them as a hanging basket, but I think I'm going to make like a bird cage out of them or some sort of a, like a Easter decor piece. I bought two of them. They are from the Garden Collection at Dollar Tree. They're just a hanging wire basket. Uh, we'll see what I can come up with. I thought they were like a cool shape, so I decided to get a couple. I also bought three more of these willow wreaths. Now, if you watched one of my previous Christmas DIY um, decor videos, I made these really cute little wreaths that hang in my formal living room, which is now my dining room, because if you noticed, we kind of switched the dining room into the whiskey room, <laughs> and we've turned our formal living room into our dining room. So that's where I am right now. I made these really pretty wreaths for my windows for Christmas time and I really like them but I wanted to make something that was more springy to put in place of the ones that I made. So I did buy three more of them. Um, I really love these anyhow. I like the natural kind of look to them and again they're just called the willow wreath. Um, they are usually all, always available at your Dollar Tree so I got three of those. Now I also picked up three of these Essentials Pantry Baskets. Now I did a DIY using these same baskets. I believe I have them in black. I don't know where they went. I use them all the time. I bought the black ones before. This time I decided to buy the white ones. They're the round shaped ones. I did see a couple different shapes. There was kind of like an oval shape, um, but I bought three of the white uh, pantry baskets and I'm gonna do some sort of a little DIY with these not sure exactly what I'm gonna do with them yet but I will definitely come up with something and um, these are available year-round and again they're the essentials baskets these I've seen people do hauls about and I had not seen them at my Dollar Tree until this last trip that I went and when I saw them, I grabbed a handful of them because I love them. They are so cute and there's so many different things that you can do with these. Check these out. Aren't those cute? The little like rustic wooden frame with the little clip that can hold like a picture or a recipe or something like that. There is um, a frame stand on the back of these. They're not very big. I want to say they're probably three by five inch, um, something along the lines of that size. I don't know if it says what they are. It doesn't say on the sticker on the back, unless there is another sticker. Some of them had little, yeah, none of these did. I did see some of them have like a little sticker attached to this little clip um, that was just, you know, what they put in there when they're selling them. Um, none of mine had that little 
tag or whatever it was. So I don't really know the size, but I think they're three by five, um, but super cute. I love this little like metal insert. I think this is so cute and I think I'm going to be able to come up with a really cute spring kind of farmhouse DIY with these. I bought a handful. I did. I'm telling you I bought a handful. I am that girl that if I see something that interests me at the Dollar Tree, I buy all of it or a good amount. So I did. I bought a handful of these, I think six, and we'll see what I can come up with with these. But I just thought these were so stinking cute. Okay, I opened these up already only because Jameson wanted to play with these. Um, these are just little Easter eggs. They're these little speckled um, pastel color Easter eggs in this little like egg crate. Super adorable, really perfect for decorating. Um, and I'm sure we'll just, you know, add these to our Easter decor this year. But Jameson likes playing with them, so I did buy a package of those. What else do I have in here? Okay. Now I'm gonna show these. These are these little hanging plaques. There's four different shapes that I bought. I actually didn't buy them in this past trip that I went to Dollar Tree. Um, I bought them previously, but I wanted to show them in this haul only because I haven't used them in anything yet, but I really want to use them in some sort of a spring decor. So, Four different shapes. They all have different sayings on the front. They have these cute little knobs that you can hang something off of. Um, really just adorable. I love the shape. Um, it's almost like a chalkboard type uh, front plate. I don't know if it actually is, but this one says blessed and thankful. There's one that says welcome home. Our nest is best. I really love the shape on that one. And then, and then it's the little things in life on that one. So one of each shape I picked up. I love these. I just think they're so, so cute. And I don't know. I'm thinking some sort of like garden theme with these, but again, not really sure yet, but I'm sure I'll come up with something. This is dried a dried flower bouquet. I've not seen these at my Dollar Tree before. This is the first year I've seen them. Um, I got the purple, like it's a deep purple color with a white flower. Again, I bought it because I haven't seen them there before, and I really like that deep purple color. I love to decorate springtime with that kind of um, lilac purple color and I also bought some faux lilac flowers that I'll show you in just a minute but yeah I thought this was just different it's interesting and I can use this in some sort of an arrangement if I pull like the pieces out and um but yeah another pickup from Dollar Tree now these I have something specific in mind that I'm gonna make out of these for Easter these little display easels. Now, they have two different options at my Dollar Tree. I bought two of each. They have a larger one, which is a clear color right here. This one is, I don't, again, it doesn't tell me size. I want to say it's probably about 10 inches from top to bottom on the large clear one. And then the smaller one is a set of two black easels. Um, maybe a slightly smaller than the big one, maybe like eight inches and then like five inches. Um, I'm guessing on these ones, but I did buy two of each and I bought it specifically for a project that I'm going to be doing. Um, I'm not sure how I'm putting it together yet, but I'm pretty sure I can make it work with these easels. So stay tuned on that one. Okay, I've seen these before at Dollar Tree. I didn't really like the black. However, I'm gonna paint them because I really love that basket weave uh, design on these little vases. Uh, perfect size, they're actually a little bit larger. For a dollar, I thought it, was, thought it was a great price. They didn't have many left. I think these are left over from the fall, if I'm not incorrect. Um, but they are these just really adorable like vases or jars with this gorgeous little basket weave print on the front or basket weave design um, all around the jar. I thought if these were painted a chalk white, they would be really, really pretty. Um, and so yeah, I did get two of those. 
some other glassware that I picked up, which was new that I have not seen at Dollar Tree before, is these, I think these are either a tea light holder or an actual glass right here. I love the shape of these. Now, I think you could definitely use these for like a stemless wine glass, but I am not. You know me, I like to make things other things. So I bought five of them really loved the shape i'm thinking like a staggered um candelabra something like that but yeah first time seeing these and these are like really pretty i think the shape is really pretty if you even use these just for like your regular tableware glasses i think they're really nice so i bought five of those spanish moss lots of easter decor I've seen people use the Spanish moss. I've used the Spanish moss in years before. So I did pick up two more packets of Spanish moss. Um, they had a fresh supply of it at Dollar Tree. I anticipate that it probably goes fast this time of year. So if you want Spanish moss for a dollar, grab it soon. All right, remember how I said lilacs. I found some lilacs. I love lilacs. These ones are not bad either. I really feel like Dollar Tree is stepping up their game with their floral selection. Um, they had a few different color options. They had some darker purple, some lighter purple. I only picked up one of the darker and then I think three of the lighter ones. But yeah, I love lilac this time of year. I'm gonna incorporate it in some sort of a floral arrangement or maybe a piece for my dining room table. But yeah, I thought this with those really pretty dried Right here, that dried flower bouquet, the deep purple from that would look really, really pretty together. So I grabbed those. Then a couple more Easter things that I found. Who else is loving these little metal decor words that the Dollar Tree just put out this year? Um, I saw them at Thanksgiving time, I saw them at Christmas, um, I saw them at Valentine's Day, and now I see them at Easter. And this one says, Spring Bunny and Welcome. I always grab them whenever I see them for every season because I just think these are really, like that's a good buy. That's a good buy. I would actually pay a dollar for one of them, I think. I think I would. I think I would pay a dollar for one and you're getting three in the package. So really good buy on those. Also, these little pink pearl stickers. I've used these in scrapbooking. I've used them for pocket letters. Again, really good embellishment for your Easter or spring decor. Some 216 of these little sticky light pink pearl stickers from the Jot brand. I did grab some of those. And then I also found these really cute wooden pack of five carrots. And I think they're ornaments. Um, they're obviously not painted yet, but again, they'd be really cute in some sort of a spring Easter um, project. So I bought two packages of them just so that I had 10 carrots. Um, something in mind for this, we'll see. But another cute thing to just have on hand. And then I did also pick up two more of the little succulents as I have right here. I used a succulent in one of my previous projects that I did for Valentine's Day, and I love their little succulents. They're on um, like a little clip on the back so you can clip them onto things, or you can pull that clip off and just use it on its own. Um, but yeah, this one is just like a light green with a little bit of pink. Actually, I bought two of the same. Two of the light pink with a little bit of, or the green with a little bit of light pink. So two of the little succulent clips. All right, so that is all I got from my haul from Dollar Tree. Make sure you stick around to see what I do with all of the stuff that I got. Comment in the comment section below if you found any of these things at your Dollar Tree. And make sure you subscribe to my channel and make sure you turn on that little notifications bell below so that you're notified whenever I post a new video. So stick around for more videos to come, you guys. We'll see you again real soon. Have a great day. Take care.